Tyrone talk about the way you were able to jump in there and, and help out kind of on short notice, I guess? Uh, yeah, it was short notice. I know I found out on the when we were warming up for the game. But you always got to be ready when you never know when your name's called or you have the time to call up. So Coach Saban always told us to be ready. You never know what can happen. Being that you're a senior now and you've been around this coaching staff for, for three years, is it, is it easier for you to kind of jump in there like that than, than maybe a you know a freshman or a sophomore? I just basically, if you study and do all the things coach tell you to do, you, you should be ready. And just get the butterflies out, out of the way first. But pretty much, you should, I was just ready when he called me. How big were, were the butterflies? <laughs> they were pretty big. <laughs> but they went away after the first play. When did you find out? It was, it was uh, you or, and he couldn't go and all that kind of stuff? Uh, I, I had doubt. I think about it during practice during the week, but I wasn't sure until we warmed up for the game. So it was like last minute. Are you still kind of approaching this week? I mean, given it's ribs and we don't know from day to day that you might have to go back out there and do it again. All right, I, I'm approaching like it can happen again. So. I'm ready if they call me. I hate to ask you this, but kick coverage. What, have you guys been able to pinpoint anything yet? Uh, just got to do better on kickoff coverage, but we're working on it in practice. Anything in, anything specific? Uh, nah. Okay. <laughs> what about the penalties in that area? Yeah. You, what's been the response in practice because of those? It is always bad to have penalties, so we need we working on it to, uh, to eliminate all the penalties, you know. So there's just things we need to work on and be more disciplined on. Was there one particular tackle or, or sack or play in particular that just kind of jumps out that you're really proud of from the, from the last game? Uh, or just a favorite? <laughs> well, I, I just – Every play, I just wanted to um, play hard and just do do my assignment. So it just really wasn't a, a play. I just wanted to stay focused on what I was doing. It was a career high and everything for tackles and stuff. Did you hear much from family or friends? Yeah, stuff? I had a lot of text messages after the game. Whatever, got a lot of compliments. It seems like it might be the mentality of this whole team that they're ready to go at any time. Is that is that the case? Whenever their numbers call. Yeah, you, well, we should be, just in case. You never know what, what can happen, so you've got to be ready. Ty, since you have been around here a while, and as you look around, are there more game-ready players than there were when you first got here? Uh, yeah, it is. It just is by what co way coaches um, have us going in practice. He have us ready for the game, everybody. Second string, third string, we all ready the way we practice. So 